You know how he makes coffee? And I pointed it over to him. What's up, guys? Brian here. Just wanted to do a quick little live video and show you guys some of the talent of my buddy Brian. Me and him used to drive tanker trucks together. We got a good friendship. You know, we've been friends for a while. Um, anyways, he's finishing the paint on the passenger side door. Figured I'd show you guys some of his work. Um, well, I got you here. I'm not bothering you, no, am I? not at all. You're good. I just had to look. Yeah, I was just, I thought of you after I told him that story. I was just, I had to tell you that. That's why I called you that day. Right? And I, I really do have a lot of fun delivering down there. It's, I got guys that just rather be over the mountain. I handle a lot of Seattle business. And I call them my people. Oh, I drag this, my truck around down there like this fucking little Honda car. No worries. I smile and wave. Even if I make people mad, I smile and wave. I thought you blew them kisses, Brian. I blew them kisses, too. That's usually <laughs> people on the corners. <laughs> no, one of, one of the people that, you know, like they beg on the corners where we share our lunch with. Check out that mountain. Got a beautiful view. She came up to the corner the other day. She's like, there you are. I haven't seen you in so long. Trying to zoom out. There we go. Anyways, what are you guys up to? It is like 85, 90 degrees. Oh, it's getting pretty warm. Um, I finished placing the valve cover gasket on the dump truck early this morning, and then I got called out to Seattle to do some paving. It's pretty sweet. Um, it was just a one load and done type deal. Six hour minimum. That's pretty sweet. Anyways, guys, just wanted to check in and show you guys some of his work. You know. Anyways, don't forget to pound that like button, pound that subscribe button. I'll catch you later. They're honest. If they're holding the doors for people and being nice and saying nice things and being cool. Thanks, Rodriguez. Where are you at right now? What are you What are you up to? I come back with a lot of the stories from those places that everybody loves hearing whatever I got. Yeah, I see some pretty crazy stuff. No lies. It's all on a day's adventure. I love how he's got his little paintbrush set up <laughs> with the tape. It's pretty sweet. try and get some uh, maybe I'll throw up a little video of him doing some airbrushing when he starts doing the airbrushing that'd be pretty cool not every day you get to see somebody do airbrushing you know he's pretty good at it so he just got his son a Dodge Dart and the other one's got a C10. Anyways, guys, thought I'd just check in and say hi. Show you guys painting in progress. Pretty sweet. Yep. Yep. No, they they're generally pretty good. You know, and that's sort of the thing where I look at. Sort of helping them out, sharing with them, and like I got life pretty damn good at this day.
but they they ask me for money and whatnot. I usually won't always give that, but I tell them. They they asked for a quarter one day, and I was like, well, they asked me for some change, quarter. And I said, well, I I got to be out here six days a week just to make change. So, tell you what, you know, let's see what I got in my lunchbox. And that's how I handle that. But the last guy I did that for and shared lunch with, you wound up not having any teeth. <laughs> I said, today's your lucky day. He's like, oh yeah? I said, what do you want? Offered him two different kinds of bags of chips. He says, you don't like either one of them. I'm like, okay, what else? All right, I got this, I think I had a roast beef sandwich. He didn't like roast beef sandwich. I was like, wow, that's messed up. You don't like a roast yeah, beef sandwich. That's not American right there. So then he says, I'm down to like apples and orange. I got cheese sticks and hard boiled eggs. And I got, because I eat a lot of food. And like finally come down to apples left over. And he finally just turns to me and goes, thank you. That was very nice of you, very generous of you. Moves his hand from the front of his face. He has no teeth. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I guess I should have gave him a buck. <laughs> I don't know what he would have done with a buck, but he couldn't eat nothing in my lunchbox. So that was, you know, that was that. But and he he just said thanks and walked on the way. I I, I couldn't help him. <laughs> You know, I, I take those situations that people generally would be freaked out about and try to turn them into something good. That's that's really how you got to work with people down there because they're not that bad. They're just having a rough time. Yeah, I don't think so. I mean, maybe if you got off on the wrong foot down there, but for the most part, and... I see them day after day. Right, circumstances. Yeah. But yeah, every day that's my goal downtown is to help people out and be good to people and make people understand that it's not going to be as bad as they think it is. Even though people are upset with the current situation, believe me, I see every bicycle getting pedaled in the wrong direction down there. <laughs> it's like, you couldn't afford that bike. You stole it. I am. I worked today. I was supposed to go up to the chopper shop and I didn't make it. So I just got done early and called my buddy up and says, hey, let's paint. Well, you're going to like this. I worked 14 hours yesterday, which is sort of a normal thing. Worked 14 hours yesterday, busted home, went to North Bend. Trevor and I took care of Dad's property. We got home last night, 9.30, 9.45, I showered. Got up at 2.25 this morning, showered, went to work. Put in 10 and a half hour a day. You know, 14 hours is only two hours more than a half a day, right? <laughs> is that what it is? <laughs> <laughs> I call 12 hour days half days yeah, at yeah. big rigs. We look at 12s normal. <laughs> But yeah, no, I was like, I know it was less than four and a half hours sleep, so. It was good. Well, see, that's why I live five miles from where I work, because I couldn't do like, what you do. I call it getting paid to drive home. Yeah. Man, you put 
time with that company though. 25 years. 25 years. <laughs> Dude, you rock. That is a long time. <laughs> I remember my first day going out on the road with you. You know that? You should know where. You should remember that. Day. Cadman. Yep. Just about ran off the road, fell out of the truck. <laughs> you flipped the visor down on me. That's what you did. We we're driving in a garbage truck, right hand drive. Uh huh. And he's riding hang on. And I'm driving for the first time. So the pedals are upright a little bit. You're standing. And he flips the visor down. My head's at the top of the visor. And I. Yeah, I'm a lot taller than this guy. Sort of like yours, your height. Uh huh. So, yeah, you flip that visor down. I'm driving, I can't see <laughs> around Northeast Union Hill. Yeah. I don't know if we ran over the curb, but we definitely got articulate with everything. <laughs> you were freaking out because that was like sort of the first time letting me drive that stuff. And, you know, you're responsible for me at that time. What'd you find? Yeah. Jeez, that was one fun thing about that job. Everything we found. Is that good? Yeah. Really? I'll never forget the guy that I rolled up to his house and he sort of said to me, like, you know, the, the computer boxes because the Mexican guys didn't want it. Yeah. What? Yeah, we always get free shit in the garbage, whether it's a pizza or. <laughs> well, we got a lot of pizzas, didn't we? <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Evans? <laughs> but, uh. Yeah, I know. We, we definitely collected some cool shit. Oh, and I was up off in Kirkland today off 8th Street. You know, across from the city of Kirkland. What do you guys think? I just the flames. That's pretty cool, huh? Some flames coming out of the stack. <sighs> we, I waited a year to get this side of the truck. <laughs> it's so tough when me and him actually have time, you know, to do this kind of thing. You know, I heard he had a little bit of, a, and I need to check in with but, him, truthfully. Uh, you know, it's going to be worth it. Scare, it's bud. pretty cool. Yeah. The prostate kind of stuff, you know. Yeah. I, mean, I, I think he took a little time off work, got to take care of him. I talked to his daughter every uh, I see her driving. We pass each other on the road every so often. I, I think everything's okay. I'm not 100%. I need to really check up with them. Yeah, he, he probably was taking some personal time for that. But yeah, I do need to check in with them. Yeah, definitely, sure will. So, is your wife writing anything new lately? Really? That's so cool. Wow. Well. All I know is I want a signed copy of something she wrote to, to me. <laughs> I will, I will, but I don't run on that side of the everything, so I want something personalized to me. I mean, I can do it. I can do it.
We're about, we're about the first book published. I, I, I never knew what was what, but I mean, I just, I think that's something that she should have, you know. I mean, once I get to collecting her stuff, then I'll make sure, you know. That's so cool. Really? Wow. All right, that's that's super cool. Ten <laughs> percent. You would have never thought that all the mirrors back, huh? Well, true. You had you you got to see a lot more of that back then than I would remember. Well, you better tell me to keep painting then. Damn you. <laughs> right. Oh yeah, I was uh, out your way the other week for delivery. Um, is that where it is? Right after the reptile zoo place or whatever. Wait, no. Well, I still call Goldburn all that crap your place. <laughs> yeah, no, no. I was in Goldburn. No. No, no, they wouldn't do that. No. <laughs> no. 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 They they couldn't. They got they got people coming to that stuff. I wonder if I did that on the other side. Did um I light? I think so. What do you guys think? Looks pretty sweet, huh? Right on. Yep, yep, no. Nope. I'll send you a picture of this one. This is super cool. Anyways, guys. Right don't on. forget to Thanks, cool, hit that.